Hello, all you Quaker Stuff fans out there. Here's our update for February of 2022. Uh, first, the good stuff. The aluminum is finally here. It arrived on January 24th, and more shipments have come since then. Um, in May of 2021, we began placing quarterly orders uh, based on our sales predictions, and these are the shipments we've been waiting for. We hope this will end the delays and our next quarterly shipment comes in on time. In this environment, no one, no one is giving us hard dates, so we'll just have to wait and see. Also, the barrel tubular lock mechanisms came in and were sold out rapidly. So more should be here any day, and they are the only ingredient that we get from outside of North America and we all know that story. So I've said before, and I'll say it again, recycle your aluminum and other raw materials. Um, so we can avoid these types of disruptions in our communities and our businesses in the future. Aluminum is the easiest material to recycle. And these types of recycled raw materials make us less reliant on foreign producers and supply chain dis uh, disruptions. So, you know, recycling is a critical part of the modern aluminum business. Making recycled aluminum only takes 5% of the energy needed to make new aluminum, reducing carbon emissions and having money for businesses and, and consumers. And that's from the aluminum.org uh, organization. Sales continue to ride in. Um, as I've said this before, and I'll repeat it again, sales keep coming in and people are being very patient with us um, and our current production queue we are running. Production is currently outpacing sales and we are making headway on the back orders. The feedback and reviews have been fantastic and people seem to be loving the rack. Um, as always, read the delivery estimate FAQ on our FAQ page to keep abreast of everything. It is our most updated communication to all of you. And it has the up to the day status on all orders, our process and our progress. The CNC machines have been great and at times frustrating. They're incredibly efficient, yet one of the machines has had its motor break down twice. Uh, the last occurrence caused a three week delay in production. It's not good, obviously, but we had enough stock uh, in parts that we only lost one day of shipments. We've also started a second shift at the machine shop with three new CNC operators, and we should be able to boost production by approximately 40% within the next couple of months. We're also onboarding another assembly person, and we've been training staff and getting our ducks in a row for the increase. As most of you already know, our pre-sales are allowing us to procure the funds that we need to order more aluminum, making it possible for us to produce and ship more quickly. So we build the panel plan, um, we work the plan, we iterate the plan, we continue to work the plan. Don't forget to maintain your rack. Just like anything, your bike, your car, our rack will last longer um, and perform better if you wash it and maintain it. Winter salts are very corrosive and the only defense is say, soap and water. So keep your rack clean. Order now and get in the queue. Um, please know that the timeline for receiving your rack is based on factors that were and are practically out of our control still getting aluminum, other vendors, repair technicians, but we've been executing our plan 
to scale, and it's just that we're very delayed. The sooner you order and get in the queue, the quicker we get you your rack, period. Over 990 people who participated in our pre-sales campaigns now own a new Quick Rack Mach 2. When they ordered, they knew it might take up to six months, and it has worked for them, and it will work for you too. So keep in mind, if you're concerned about putting your money up and making the advanced investment in our rack, we suggest using a credit card that is guaranteed versus a debit card that is not. I'm gonna say that every time. Something you need to know about credit cards and debit cards. Um, remember also that if any of this is ever a problem once you order, um, do not hesitate to contact us or ask us for a refund. We get it, we know this is frustrating. Lastly, um, I know I keep saying this, but it, this has been a very interesting journey and humbling experience. Never in my career um, have I been involved in a company that had this much interest, success, and struggles all at the same time. I hope we all learn from each other and our reliance on our supply chains to live our daily lives, and I know I sure have. So keep riding, keep healthy, and thanks again.